Hi friends. So today we are going to make a spaghetti pasta. It's going to be a tomato plus cheese based pasta. So let's look into the ingredients now. So here we have about one big size onion and a small one. So it's about two onions totally. A cup of carrot and then I have a cup of cabbage and then I have about five to six cloves of garlic finely chopped and julienne's and then I have a tomato puree from four to five small tomatoes. Now let's look into rest of the ingredients. So I've taken this spaghetti. This is the brand that I've used which is Borges. Right, I've taken about half of the pack and this is the boiled or blanched spaghetti. So you'll have to keep about a liter of water and then add a pinch of salt and about two to three spoons of oil and then you get this, uh, you know, when, when the water is boiling hot, just put the spaghetti in so it all gets, you know, this is, this is the consistency you should have. See, I'm able to split this open. And once it is done, keep it in a colander like this and add a bit of oil so it doesn't stick to each other. Now let's see the next ingredient. The next one we have here is corn flour. It's just to give a little bit of thickening uh, to the sauce that we're going to prepare, which is a white sauce. Okay. The next thing that I've considered here is my cheese spread. You can use either this one or if you have cheese cubes, you could use that as well. And then I have a cup of milk. Uh, so first we're going to add the cloves, garlic cloves. I have added the garlic cloves here. Next goes in the onion. Okay. This is my cabbage. I am just going to saute it a bit. Now next goes in my carrot. That is enough for the veggies to cook here. Now I'm going to pour the tomato puree and let's give it a slight mix. Now I added a half a spoon of turmeric and then I'm going to add half a spoon of chili powder. So you can add about two spoons of tomato puree or tomato ketchup in case you want this to be a little tangy. Now you can see this is all cooked. It, it has become a little soft now. At this point we can switch off the flame and I'm going to keep this separate. Okay. Now I've kept these veggies separately mixed with tomato puree. Now I'm going to prepare the white sauce right here. In the pan I'm going to pour a cup of milk. Okay. Now while this milk is boiling I'm going to add about a spoon and a half of cheese. So I have a bit of corn flour mixed with milk which I'm going to add it to this. So our gravy thicken. Now you can see that this sauce has become really thick. This is the cheese sauce or the white sauce that we call. Okay. Now into the sauce I'm going to add the veggies that we have already stir fried. And give it a good mix. Wow, we can see the thick creamy texture, right? Now into this goes a spaghetti. I'm gonna add in a spaghetti into this. See how beautiful it is, right? Now you can see after this is mixed, it's a little thick. If you want it a little, uh, you know, gooey, then you can add a bit of water. I've added the pasta starch. Okay, now it looks extremely creamy. And wow, our pasta is done. Now I'm going to plate it.